Well, I'm going to talk about two biomes that I consider the most important ones in the whole world. The first one is the savanna. It is basically a running grassland scattered with scrubs and insulated trees, which can be found between a tropical rainforest and a desert biome. Savannas are also known as tropical grasslands. They are found below and near below the equator. Savannas have a warm temperature and they have two seasons, a very long dry season, that is winter, and a very long wet season, that is summer. It only rains for each fall in the dry season. In the summer, there is a lot of rains. The African savannas are the most known in the whole world. We can find a variety of many animals in the savanna, the most extensive ones, like elephants, black rhinos, giraffes, lions, hyenas, etc. They fight each other for survival and they help each other in the same part of the ecosystem, like this video that shows how they, how the lions hold an antelope and how the hyenas eat as an scavenger. Now let's talk about the serious forests. The serious forests can be found in the eastern half of North America and the middle of Europe. Some of the major areas are in Russia, Japan and eastern China. South America has two big areas of the serious forests, like Chile and the middle east coast of Paraguay. The average temperature of the serious forest is of 50 Fahrenheit. The average rainfall is 30 to 60 inches a year. The serious forests have five different zones. The first one are the three statum zones, like where is the most tallest trees like oak, mean, maple, elm, etc. The other part is where is the small tree or sapling zone, is the second zone. This zone has young and short trees. The third zone is called the shrub zone. Some of the shrubs in this zone are rhododendrons, azaleas, mountain laurels, and hawkberries. The herb zone is the fourth zone. They contain short plants such as herbal plants. And the final zone is the ground zone. It contains lichen, club mosses, and tree mosses. The seeds forest can have four distinct rich seasons spring, summer, autumn, and winter. In the autumn zone, the leaves change color. During the winter months, the trees lose their leaves. This is some of the most important characteristics of the deciduous forest. The animals adapt to the climate by hibernating in the winter and living off the land in the other three seasons. The animals have adapted to the land by trying the plants in the forest to see if they are good to eat or a good supply of food. Also, the trees provide shelter for them. Animals use the trees for food and water sources. Most of the animals are camouflaged to look like the ground. In the serious forest, we can find animals as cougar, bear, fox, owls, deers, and birds. Well, so this is everything for tonight. Thanks for watching us. This is Steve Reporter for you. Thanks.